All right, so uh, maybe talk a little bit about playing over the top of the guitar neck, and uh, that's something actually which I've only done on a few songs, but um, of course one of my songs became quite popular on the internet, and I was playing that way, so a lot of people associate me with that style, but uh, I've really only written a couple tunes that way, and uh, the uh, real inspiration for that for me was Preston Reed, and uh, seeing him when I was 16 years old and, and doing all that crazy stuff, and so I, I set about trying to learn what he was doing, playing over the top of the neck, and uh, what were the benefits of playing that way, and so on. So uh, the main benefit I can think of, of playing over the top of the neck is it kind of allows you to come over and do percussive things a little bit easier than if you're under here, um, and you can do uh, uh, or play the bass parts with the left hand and do the melody with the right hand, tapping notes, and so on. So maybe just a basic kind of pattern here. You can, uh, when you do these hammer-ons over the top of the neck, uh, I have the, the thumb right on the, uh, sort of in the middle of the back of the neck, and then a lot of times I'll stap, stack the uh, middle finger on top of the index finger, and that way you're using two fingers to actually hammer on rather than one. I think it gives you a little bit more strength there to hammer those on that way. And you can, depending on what tuning you're using, I have it... Uh, right now C G D G A D. So you can tap you can tap just the two low ones and get uh, like a power chord or a root in fifth. Or if you include the fourth string, you'll you'll get the ninth interval. So one five nine. Just like that. So uh, when I was starting to learn this I noticed my forearm hurt quite a bit because I think you're kind of using different muscles really than you do when you're down here. So you might notice that too as you start to practice this stuff, but it uh, gets easier with time, of course, like everything. So, something like that, a little exercise you can practice just to get the left hand used to doing this. So I'm tapping here, and then coming over hitting the face of the guitar, 